welcome back so as you can see today we are working on Cody 17 aka Krypton so I've been uh, messing around with it secretly for a while uh, I still like 16 a little better but you have to adjust the times because eventually they're gonna shift everything over to 17 anyway so today I'm going to bring you one of the builds that is my favorite on uh, Cody 17 in addition I'll also show you how to install it so the first thing you need to do with Cody 17 is you got to go to your settings you have to go to down to add-ons over here the unknown sources now has to be checked so now that you've checked the unknown sources you're able to add repositories uh, any add-ons or anything like that that you want to add to it this is a new step to the process from Cody 16 so now that I've done that I'll go down to my file manager and I add a source so this this process right here is relatively the same not only has some other things changed but the link to one of my my favorite repo builds Aries wizard also changed so here's their new address. So it's http colon four slash four slash Aries project, just like you see it on the screen. Dot com slash magic. So that's a change uh, from what it used to be. And then as before, we still can name it whatever we want. I keep it simple. Aries, good to go. So I click OK. Alright, so from there, you back out to your to your main menu. This is now your main menu. Everything's over here on the left. So you want to go down to add-ons. And so you're looking for where you want to install from zip file. Well, it's inside of this little box now. Go into the box, install from zip file, and then right here at the top is our Aries Wizard. Click repository Aries project.zip. Okay, from there, so now that you saw the, the Aries Wizard, you back out. Okay, now that you've done that, you go up to install from repository, you go to Aries uh, Wizard, program add ons, and then you have your Aries Wizard. So over here, you want to hit install. So now you see the Aries wizard is enabled. Double click it and go ahead and click open. <clears throat> it's going to check for updates. So it always shows that you're using an unstable version of Cody. Please be aware. Just go ahead and disregard that because the next step that I'm going to show you kind of bypasses that. Uh, that's just let you know that if you're also trying to still run add-ons for Cody Jarvis 16 that you're gonna have issues with your builds but anyway so the standard Aries wizard you go to browse build and I'm gonna show you the one that I think and I'll also walk you through it and, and show to tell you why so it's actually this one right here I'm not gonna attempt to say this name don't even know how it's supposed to be pronounced but this is it right here so you click this and if you look so you have the, the light BB for the Fire Stick Edition, Mini BB, uh, which I have not messed around with yet. And then you have your light BB, your Krypton Edition, which is what we're going to uh, go ahead and go to now. So that's the light BB Krypton Edition. So install. Okay, so now that that's done, it's going to ask you if you want to back up the skin and profile. I'm actually on my computer, so I have the memory and the RAM to do so. If you're on the Fire Stick, uh, maybe, maybe not. One gig of RAM. 
if you're on an Android box with one gig of RAM, you, you probably still could. I always click yes anyway. So after you click yes, then you'll go through configuration save. Alright, so now that that's done, it's going to tell you that coding needs to be closed. So you click OK to close it. Okay, so now here we are. My build is loaded. Everything looks like good to go. Have my different sections, which I'll go over in a different video, a review of this um, this this Cody load. But like I said, once again, this is one of my uh, new favorite loads from from Aries.